to um, to Trixie. Yes. And when you first found out that you were pregnant yes. with her, what was that time like? Um, that was it was an interesting time because I I, um, I was so sick. So I mm. got when I realised I was pregnant, I had the most horrendous morning sickness. It was terrible. It was so bad. In fact, it was what Kate Middleton had, but I had it before her, so she, she sort copied of copied me. me. Yeah. Uh, but I was hospitalised. I was on a drip. Uh, I couldn't, I was so nauseous, I couldn't eat, uh, I couldn't get off the couch. And so for me, you know, obviously being pregnant and the excitement mm. of that and knowing this little yeah. person's going to come into the world and what a blessing. Uh, it was also really tough. Yeah. And, uh, and, and you mum, had to work through that too. I did have to work through that. And also I hadn't revealed publicly that I was pregnant. So I, you know, had to do a bit of stiff upper lip and mm. pretend I wasn't so sick. Uh, but mum just swept in and um, and she took care of me and supported me. And mind you, having said that, it, my, all my family did. Yeah. Um, you know, my dad would come over with meals and every... I mean, I have been so lucky through um, that pregnancy, which was quite tough to have so yeah. many you know, great friends because and family. Because you didn't get the... I was... When I fell pregnant with Bax was really unwell for um, about six weeks, yeah. from six weeks to 12 weeks where I was on the couch, migraine, hideous. But then the beautiful hormones kicked in. Yeah. They didn't kick no, in No, I never you. got those ones. Never, <laughs> through the whole pregnancy, did I feel good. Uh, and it, which is an interesting um, dichotomy because my brain, my mind was so excited. I know. And yet yeah. my body was like, was this is you. not great. Yeah. To the point where, it, you know, this is such a funny reaction, but the day that I had Trixie, I was so excited. There she is in my arms. And I just wanted to get up and go for a run and eat a Big Mac. Because I was like, and you I did find eat I a did, Big Mac. I did. Well, it was a bit cruel because my <laughs> hospital room, the window looked out at McDonald's. So that was. When I fair. came to visit you, there's just all <laughs> Macca's wrappings everywhere. Having a good time in here? I shouldn't be saying that. So funny. Because that's not necessarily um, the way you should eat when you're a new mum. And I have since uh, <laughs> taken to eating yeah, really right. well. But I was, it was like my body through the pregnancy, I was being poisoned. Yeah. So I felt the whole, whatever those hormones were, the progesterone, they weren't working for me. Yeah. And the minute they stopped when she was born, I just felt myself again. Wow. That was amazing. Mind you, I haven't been for that run yet. So. Yeah. And you'll never go for <laughs> I won't that. Let's go for be that honest. Run.